Okay, here we've got the little square garden that's only supposed to be 4x4, four four, but it is coming all over the place. You see the cucumbers are climbing out the sides. The big yellow flowers you see there, that's the butternut squash. Let's see, here we have bell pepper plants, red and green bell peppers. Here's our crooked neck or yellow squash. What do we have down here? What in the world is that I see beyond that flower? Ooh, looks like a nice squash we got there. What do we have in here? All kinds of little squashies in there. Let's see, what do I see down in there? What is that? Oh my gosh, not another nice big squash land there. We're going to have to come get that later. Anyhow, there's Mr. Owl. He keeps all the birds away. Here's the Padron peppers. Now we've got the Daddle peppers. And here's my magnificent tomato plant. I counted over 50 tomatoes on it at one time. And the stakes that you see over here, holding part of the plant up, all come from this one pot right here, this one plant. Actually, again, the stakes are kind of keeping the tomatoes up and bending the plant completely out of the pot. And there's my rosemary bush. And there's the two labradoodles that rule. And there's Clancy taking a break to go to the bathroom, the Chesapeake Bay Retriever. Anyhow, that's about it for the garden today. Hello, Mr. Al. Uh, I think we are just about done here. Anyhow, uh, I think what I'll do is go ahead and see if I can't get this here posted on uh, my Facebook. I have a fellow on there that thought I bought the tomatoes and squash from Walmart, so I had to prove him wrong. Adios, amigos.